Today we're going to take a closer look at neutralization. We'll take an aqueous solution of an acid. So it must have hydrogen ions. In this case we're going to use hydrochloric acid. and this has the formula HCl. So there must be chloride ions. To this we're going to add an aqueous solution of an alkali. If it's an alkali it must have hydroxide ions. And in this case, we're going to use sodium hydroxide. So there are also sodium ions. with the formula NaOH. Now when we add these together we still have an aqueous solution we have the water but in effect we have more water. The hydrogen ions from the hydrochloric acid join with the hydroxide ions to form more water. The sodium ions are still there and the chloride ions. So we now add the chloride ions and the sodium ions. So this is an aqueous solution of sodium chloride or common table salt NaCl. The hydrochloric acid, of course, is an acid. We've added an alkali, sodium hydroxide, and we've got salt, sodium chloride, and water. The sodium chloride solution is now, of course, neutral. Let's take a look at the equation then. We have HCl as an aqueous solution plus sodium hydroxide also an aqueous solution which has produced a salt sodium chloride as an aqueous solution and water as a liquid. So we can see when we add an acid to an alkali we get salt and water. We can get the salt out of the aqueous solution by evaporation.
Thank you.